All right, so for all those people that bought the DIY PC ARGB-Q3 um, and want to use the ARGB fans that came with the case with a ARGB-capable motherboard, uh, to do that, I went through quite a bit of trial and error trying to figure it out. Um, there's this really weird behavior where... I'm trying to turn it off now. Where the PC won't boot if you have the RGB header of the fan hooked up to the motherboard, as well as this, the Molex connectors connected with the three pins. So in order to, what what's this ba this basically is doing, from what I can tell, is the third pin there is the five volt line that comes with it. It doesn't have the 5 volt ground, it just has the 5 volt, which it uses for data transfer and also, I guess, power, and then it grounds it through somewhere. I, I, I don't understand the electronics of this exactly, but basically this, the controller fan passes the data signal down to match up the colors, and it also passes through 5 volt. But when you have the ARGB header connected on the motherboard, uh, which is down here in mine, that actually powers the 5 volt as well. So the fan's getting 5 volt from there and 5 volt from here, unless you take out the third pin. Or, let's see, actually, there's numbers on here. Pin 4 is the one that's populated that you have to take out. Um, so, uh, it gets 5 volt from the power supply as well as a 5 volt from the motherboard, and so the fans don't end up turning off after the first boot of the system. And then subsequent reboots. I think it trips some sort of safety on the motherboard, where it's like backfeeding power maybe, and that causes the system not to boot. That is my current theory of what happens. Alright, to illustrate what I'm talking about, I've put the third pin back in. I think it's numbered, oh, there's actually numbers on here, four. So the fourth pin, the solo pin, is the 5 volt line on Molex, uh, which is how the LEDs are powered, and I think the data, like the color data, goes down that line, I guess. I don't know how else to communicate with the other fans from the main controller fan. So, let me... Plug the attempt to plug this in. Alright. Plug done. Turn on the system. Fans, weirdly, are just starting without turning on the system. Not sure how that's functioning. So, first boot from complete power loss. Our absence of power boots fine. Colors are of the what's set the motherboard set to. Turn it off. Fans stay powered. And if I try to boot it again, nothing. It doesn't turn on. Clicks. Dead. And it won't let me turn on until I cycle the power. So, I think this is doing some sort of tripping, I, I'm not sure what exactly is happening. I want to say it's probably the motherboard, because I doubt the fan is like there's a short or something and the power supply is tripping out. I think it's a safety precaution of the motherboard or something that's detecting backfeeding of the 5 volt voltage from the fan and going into the this ARGB header right here. Not entirely sure, but if you want to use these fans with the motherboard uh, ARGB header, you gotta remove that third pin over here. So, hope this helps. Anybody else who's struggling with these really strange, janky fans.